What's up, you guys? Slim here at YCS Memphis. My boy, Asian Persuasion, you already know. And we are here with the second place uh, deck profile. What's your name and what did you play? Uh, my name is Andres Espinosa. I played Pendulum Magicians, but I decided to play Hand Traps. So, I mean, it's just a pretty standard list, but I felt like it was the best deck in the room. And it turned out to be because Kamal and me were playing almost the same exact deck. Same exact. And y'all made it to the finals. All right, man, let's see the list. So, uh, I played Triple Ash because this card is insane against Rogue. And then, like, if you can hit, like, a, a, a well-timed Pendulum car or a well time Astra. This does a lot. Uh, this card is insane. Ogre, you have to play this card. Uh, it's it's another negate against the Electromite. Uh, I played Triple Chrono and his buddy, Triple Astro and his buddy. <laughs> These guys, I drew, I drew these in the finals. Like, it's just, I lose. I lost. I couldn't do anything. Uh, I played for the other Magicians. I played Triple Harmonizing. It's the best standalone Pendulum Summon. Uh, it can make any, basically, rank four or any Synchro. Uh, I played Triple Black Fang. And then triple purple poison because this card is hard. This card breaks boards. Uh, if you leave, basically, I played in the in top 32. He left Hope Harbinger in attack mode, and it just it punished him. Uh, and then I decided to play Zanke Magician. This is the card that beat Denny. Uh, <laughs> most people don't expect that this card is like retarded. It's, I, it has such a relevant effect, and like I play Black Fang, so I can just keep reborn in this card. This card's retarded. Uh, for the other engine, I played the Dark Worm engine. This card. Uh, should be banned because uh, monkey board is banned. Yeah. <laughs> Play triple the donut uh, or double the donut, but I don't, I don't think I needed the third one. Uh, I think two was correct. Uh, the last card that I played for Pendulum uh, was Triple Magical Abductor. I think this card did way too much. Spice. Literally way too much. Than it was, more than it was supposed to do because like it's a floodgate. If you don't answer it on your turn, it's going to punish you. So I think this card is correct and it is a low scale. So the deck struggles with low scales. So it's easier just to have one. For the spells, I played double dual alliance. I hate cards that are once per turn, so I felt like this was correct. The same thing with Pendulum Call, either I open it or I don't. A lot of the times I side these two out, there's always like a like a go-to eight cards that I side out and these are two of them. Uh, I play Double Pot of Desires, because who doesn't want to draw? Yeah. Uh, Dragon Shrine, and then Foolish Burrow, uh, to basically get the Dark Room engine going. So like if you open Abductor, uh, Duos Alliance, and Dra uh, Dark, Dark Worm, it's Triple Negate uh, with just those three cards. Uh, and that's a 41 card main deck. Uh, I don't think I would change anything. There's nothing I would change in the deck. Uh, we'll go to the we'll extra deck, it's fine. Uh, I played double Electromite. This, I don't see the need for three, uh, but Kamal decided to play three. I don't think I needed three. Uh, I, it would take up a space in the extra deck. I think two is correct. I played one Decode, one Metaltron, and then one Borlo Dragon. Uh, these are to help if you get Cherry, the Decode and the Borlo, and also this is good against Masterpiece. Uh, for the Synchros, I play one Ignister. This card's at one for a reason. This card's broken. And then I decided to play the Regeki because, like, there's times where I want to push for game, and the Regeki does a lot. Uh, I play two of the, the Fusion because uh, I play Hope Harbinger, so this is how you make it, and also it helps you loop the Astrograph. I played the one Vortex. Uh, like I said, I played the Hope Harbinger. I played the uh, Absolute Dragon, Naruto, Tornado, best card of the day. Uh, the Supreme King Dark Rebellion. Are you not raw? Yeah. Oh man. This, this stole me game against uh, Slim, against um, Den Denny, against Asala. It's just it literally like, hey, you have a big card. I'm gonna take all the attack and attack over you. Yep. Uh, it doesn't target either, so it's kind of. And it broken. also activates before damage calc. That's yeah, so, so relevant. Yeah, it's, this is right. The insane. card is the same. Uh, uh, side deck. I decided to side the trap. I didn't want to main it because uh, I rather I wanted to keep the card at 41, and um, I, th I felt the third rogue was better than this. I started a triple barrier for the mirror and for like the random mech knight invoke. I felt like that was going to be like a very very like heavy showing here, so uh, I decided that. Uh, actually, glad I started that. I decided a triple evenly match because this card is the best card in the like at least the side card. Um, I felt like the FTK and the mirror match was going to be the hardest, so I decided to go play the cherries at. At times, I literally have nine of the or nine hand traps in my deck, all three of the sisters because these cards are broken. Yeah. Uh, I play two kaiju's, the two sevens because you can pendulum summon it, and it's just like you evenly match two Drago, they keep their master, and then they get kaiju, and now they get punished. Yeah. Um, and then triple twin twister because why not? Uh, my top eight, I twin twister with dark Roman and just blew them out. Shout out yeah, shout outs, man. man. Um, shout out to everybody that I test with. Shout out to Team Millennium, C uh, CGM. Shout out to Ultra Pro and Pro Play Games. Um, Everybody that, like, Andy came with me, uh, one of the biggest shout outs, uh, I said it in all my videos, I want to give a shout out to my wife and my daughter, because, I mean, without them I wouldn't be here. My girl pushed me to come, I wasn't going to come originally, because I wasn't, like, confident in the deck, 
but I mean, I'm glad it came out, and you know, it was just it was it was all worth it. It was a great experience, um, and like I wouldn't change anything. I think the deck ran perfect, and I don't I wouldn't change nothing. Show man, Sounds awesome man. All Congrats right. on getting that second place, bro. Yeah, and man. Thank you so much for the deck profile. Yeah, yeah. thanks, bro. Thank you. Thanks, sir.